Hi everyone, welcome back to Pets and Paws channel. In today's video we are going to talk about all cat breeds from A to Z. But before we start, please make sure that you are subscribed and let's jump right into the video. Abyssinian. Abyssinians are a popular breed thanks in large part to their unusual intelligence and generally extroverted, playful, willful personalities. They are said to become depressed without constant activity and the attention of their owners. Aegean. The Aegean has only very recently begun to be bred systematically, it has been domesticated for many centuries and thus has become adapted very well to humans. It is a social pet that tolerates living in an apartment rather well. It is intelligent, active, lively and also communicative, not hesitating to draw a person's attention. American Bobtail. American Bobtails are playful, social and moderately energetic. They reportedly have enough clever ingenuity to escape from rooms with closed doors and from secured cages. Being social with their owners and caretakers, they will ask for the attention they want by meowing or just by hopping into laps. American Bobtails are moderately energetic and love traveling. Thanks to their highly adaptable nature, they easily adapt to new environments and thus are very good companions for travelers. American Curl. They are very active cats that enjoy playing, but they're actually quite friendly towards people and, unlike some other breeds, are also very tolerant of children. American Wirehair. The Wirehair has an even, balanced temperament which is essentially identical to that of its American Shorthair relative. Wirehairs are equally content to play or fall asleep in their owner's laps. They have been described as cute and somewhat humorous. They are gentle and quiet, but also playful and active. They have quiet voices. American wirehairs generally prefer to stay indoors. Asian. Asians are very affectionate and good with children. They share similar traits with the Burmese. They love to play, explore and even enjoy traveling by way of a cat carrier. They are quite a talkative and rather loud cat with an apparent strong will. They enjoy interacting with people, even with strangers. Asian Semi Long Hair. The Asian Semi Long Hair is a cat breed similar to the Asian Short Hair except it has semi long fur. The breed is also known by the name Tiffany. The Tiffany is a gentle, active, and curious breed. Cats of this breed are attached to their owners, but do not always get along with other cats, since they can be quite jealous. The Asian Semi Long Hair is spirited and expects its keeper to dedicate a lot of time to it. Asian Semi Long Hairs can be very vocal and are not recommended for small apartments. Balinese. Balinese share the traits of the short-haired Siamese, and hence are notably social and playful cats with an intense interest in the activity around them and a tendency to vocalize often and persistently, albeit at a lower volume. They are reputed to have the highest intelligence of all the long-haired breeds. They are also reputed to be notably acrobatic, and to enjoy intimate contact with their owners. Bengal. Bengal cats are smart, energetic and playful, though in some rare cases they may be quite lazy. Many Bengal owners say that their Bengal naturally retrieves items, and they often enjoy playing in water. Burman. Burman cats are fairly laid back, and while you'll definitely know that they're in the house, they're not demanding your attention. They may quietly let you know that they'd like food, please, but they won't march up to you and demand to be fed right this instant. Bombay. The personality of the Bombay tends to be highly social, is marked by strong attachment to families, and is typified by a craving for attention. As a breed, they are therefore highly suitable for children. Bombay cats are happy and comfortable being strictly indoor cats. They are also great apartment cats and can comfortably be in one room, as long as all their needs are met, food, water, litter, safe and warm place to sleep, access to toys and their human. Brazilian Short Hair The Brazilian Short Hair is viable as an indoor as well as an outdoor cat, and is keen on human contact. They are very playful as kittens. As they get older, they sober up a little, but they stay fairly active. British Shorthair. British Shorthairs are an easygoing and dignified breed, not as active and playful as many, but sweet-natured and devoted to their owners, making them a favorite of animal trainers. They tend to be safe around other pets and children since they will tolerate a fair amount of physical interaction, but as a rule do not like to be picked up or carried. Burmese. Burmese are a notably people-oriented breed, maintaining their kitten-like energy and playfulness into adulthood. They are also said to have a number of overtly puppy-like characteristics, forming strong bonds with their owners and gravitating toward human activity. The cats often learn to play games such as fetch and tag. Burmilla. The Burmilla is an irreverent and independent cat who adores its owner and displays many kitten-like characteristics, even into adulthood. 
In temperament they are sociable, playful and affectionate and get along well with children and other animals. California Spangled California Spangled cats are said to be affectionate, social, curious, and extremely devoted to their owners. They are big on eye contact and being in on the action. They love to perch on places that are at shoulder or eye level so that they can see exactly what is going on. They are known for their well-honed intelligence, athletic abilities, high energy level, and accidental acrobatics. California Spangled cats love to pounce and have very sharp hunting skills. They also enjoy games that involve a large participation by their owner. Chartreuse. Chartreuse cats tend to be quiet, rarely making noises such as mewing or crying, and some are even completely mute. They are quite observant and intelligent, with some chartreuse learning to operate radio on, off buttons and to open screen door latches. They take about two years to reach adulthood. Chartreuse cats are playful cats well into their adult years. Some can be taught to fetch small objects in the same manner as a dog. Chartreuse are good with children and other animals. They are non-aggressive, affectionate, good travelers and generally very healthy. Chartreuse tend to bond with one person in their household, preferring to be in their general vicinity, often following their favored person from room to room, though they are still loving and affectionate to the other members of the household. Chowsey. Because breeders outcross the foundation jungle cats to mostly intelligent, outgoing breeds such as the Abyssinian and Oriental Shorthair, Chauseys are intelligent, active, athletic cats. They are often very busy, as kittens. As adults, they are quieter, but they still retain a playfulness and lifelong curiosity. Chazis do not like to be alone. They need to have other cats as companions or have human company most of the time. Chazis get along well with dogs, too, and will do fine if raised with a canine in the house. Additionally, Chazis form deep bonds with people. They are loyal, and may have difficulty adjusting if rehomed as adults. Color Point Short Hair the Color Point Shorthair is a highly intelligent, playful, and people-friendly breed. They are extremely affectionate and outgoing and enjoy lounging around and playing with people, causing them to also be described as extroverts. They can also be very sensitive with nervous temperaments, which do not adapt well to changes of environment or to strangers. Like Siamese, they can be extremely vocal and attention-demanding, feeling a need for human companionship. They have over 100 vocal sounds, much more than other breeds, making for very unusual meows. Males are sometimes found to be overly aggressive towards other animals and will fight with other cats whenever they feel their territory has been invaded or just to express dominance. Cornish Rex. Incredibly quick-witted and unstoppably energetic, the Cornish Rex may be the most sociable breed of cat available today. They always love a good joke as long as it's not on them. Often described as determinedly outgoing, these cats will constantly be at the side of any human that they claimed as their own. Adept at climbing, jumping, sprinting, and chasing, Cornish Rexes are quite skilled at getting into every nook and cranny of a home. If you choose to adopt one, be sure to put all of your breakables inside of cupboards, preferably with locks. Anything that's left on a shelf or in plain view is in danger of being swatted to the ground by a curious corny. Simric. Simric is quite active, it is very playful and will follow you around the house. When relaxing, it will nap peacefully on your lap or curl up nearby where it can keep an eye on you. A Simric is an intelligent cat who is always ready to learn new tricks. You can teach them to fetch and come, and they will quickly learn how to open doors with their paws. If you set boundaries, they will be willing to accept your wishes, especially if you offer them an acceptable alternative. Devon Rex. The typical Devon is active, mischievous, playful, and very people-oriented. They have been described as a cross between a cat, a dog and a monkey, or, more famously, as, a monkey in a cat suit. They are high jumpers and will try to occupy any space large enough to admit them. With this trait, they are often found in odd nooks and crannies of a closet, shelf, or laundry basket. Devons prefer to be in high places and will go to great lengths to get to the highest spot in a room. Egyptian Mao. The Mao is known for having what is considered a loyal, playful and friendly personality. Mouse are more temperature sensitive than most breeds, they are fond of very warm temperatures. European Shorthair The breed has developed from the natural mouse hunters of Europe with the wish to strengthen the most desirable personality traits of the domestic cats. Most European Shorthairs are strong and active, and as a rule they are friendly towards people of all ages. They get on well with other cats and tolerate dogs well. European Shorthairs are intelligent and playful and most of them are expert at keeping houses and gardens free of all types of rodents.
They tend to handle changes in an active home very well, making them suitable for families with children. Exotic short hair. Exotic short hairs have a gentle and calm personality reminiscent of the Persian, but are generally livelier than their long-haired ancestors. Curious and playful, they are friendly to other cats and dogs, but they don't like being left alone and need the presence of their owner. They tend to show more affection and loyalty than most breeds and make excellent lap cats. Their calm, steady nature makes them ideal apartment cats for city dwellers. Nonetheless, exotics retain some of the energetic spark of the American shorthair, and they are often capable mouse hunters. Foldex. Foldex cats have an affectionate personality and are loyal to their owners, enjoying petting and cuddling, and are considered to be great lap cats. Foldexes have the high curiosity drive to explore, and have an easy-going nature, approaching strangers without hesitation. They get along with children and other pets. Foldexes are ideal for potential owners who live in an apartment, as they are not a vocal breed. The Foldex is an intelligent breed that likes to play with toys and puzzles. German Rex. A German Rex cat is very friendly and quickly bonds with its human. It is lively, playful, and intelligent. Its temperament is much the same as a Cornish Rex. Havana Brown. First and foremost, it's essential to know that the Havana Brown lives for companionship and human interaction. If you are gone for long stretches of time, the Havana Brown is not the right breed for you. Extremely inquisitive and intelligent, the Havana Brown loves discovering new things. She will often examine unknown objects by touching them with her paws. This breed also communicates with her paws, touching her owner for food, love, or playtime. Highlander. Despite the big cat look, the Highlander is a human-oriented, friendly and playful cat, and very active and confident. Himalayan or Colorpoint Persian. Himalayan cats are well known for their sweet and gentle temperaments. They will be quite happy sitting on your lap and getting plenty of attention, but they are equally happy to entertain themselves if you need to go out for the day. They can be a little standoffish with strangers, reserving their true affection for close members of their families. Japanese Bobtail. This breed is good for families. Due to their affectionate nature, they are well-suited pets for children and communicate with people using soft chirpy noises. This breed is highly attracted to water, very smart, and known for playful behavior, always full of energy and mischief. A very loyal breed, bobtails make great companions. Javanese or Colorpoint Longhair. It is noted as an intelligent cat and tends to vocalize, often for no apparent reason. This is also a trait of the Siamese ancestor. They are notably fond of play, jumping and human contact, vocalizing, and getting into whatever their owners are doing and can become depressed if not regularly entertained by humans or other pets. They are reportedly good mouse hunters. Cow Manny. They are devoted to their owners and are curious, intelligent cats who have an enduring sense of naughtiness. They are a quite inquisitive cat and love to play a good game of fetch before curling up with you for a warm nap. Known as the White Gem, the Cow Manny was rumored to be highly coveted by Thai royalty and is thought to bring good luck to those fortunate enough to have one. Korit. The Korit has a very different temperament from other Thailand-derived cat breeds. They are intelligent, with a good memory. If they are brought to a place they have never been before, they can return home on their own. If they are living in a big group, they will use a hierarchy system. When fed, the sergeant of the group will eat first and then the other cats follow the hierarchy, though they will let kittens eat first. Female cats will teach their litters to survive and protect themselves by taking some small animals for the kittens to play with for practice. Corret cats can remember their owner. If they see a stranger they might scare or make a noise, but they will run to their owner and play with them. Le Perm. The breed is genetically unique and not related to any other Rex cat varieties, having a dominant gene causing their curly coats. They have an elegant and athletic build and are affectionate, active, and outgoing in character. They are reputed to be hypoallergenic cats, provoking a significantly lower level of an allergic response in humans than normal cats. Lycoi. Lycoi cats are descendants of feral cats, and those genes remain strong. These cats are exceptional hunters and have excellent survival instincts. They don't make the best lap cats because of their ancestry, they prefer to keep moving instead. While they may look messy and unkempt, the Lycoi is anything but feral these days. They have wonderful personalities, bonding incredibly well with their people. They are the epitome of curiosity, melding the typical cat stereotypes. This quality makes them both trainable and entertaining. Maine Coon. The Maine Coon is one of the most affectionate and loving of all cat breeds, and they thrive off of human contact. 
Indeed, these cats can often be seen following their owners around the home, similar to dogs, and are happiest when with their owners. That being said, they aren't needy or clingy and are independent animals that are happy to do their own thing. They love affection but are happy to be quiet observers of your activities in the background. Manx. Manx cats are considered to be very social cats and friendly to just about everyone. They are usually very attached to their people. However, they can be a bit aloof and shy with strangers. Mekong Bobtail. The Mekong Bobtail is a smart and savvy cat, so owners have to make sure they can keep up with their cat's demands. These cats aren't known for their quiet natures, so if you're looking for a peaceful companion who enjoys long relaxing naps, sometimes stretching for hours and hours, then the Mekong Bobtail is not for you. They can be loud, possibly thanks to their Siamese heritage, so they won't be shy in coming forward if they're hungry or you're simply not giving them enough attention. Minskin. Minskin cats are often described as exotic and alien-like, they are sweet-tempered and affectionate cats that are playful but not destructive. They are a small breed that requires little grooming and gets along with other animals and humans. Munchkin. These cats are quite intelligent. They are also people-pleasers, so they are straightforward to train. They can be taught to do tricks like dogs and generally listen to any commands you give them. Munchkins are not as stubborn as some other cat breeds. These cats are amiable in most cases and they love their people and strangers equally. They do require quite a bit of attention, or they can become excessively needy. Nebbling. Nebbling cats are lively, playful, affectionate, good-natured and intelligent. The cat's mild-mannered state and personality may not always reflect the relatively high level of intelligence often found in the breed. In spite of the fact that it is an active cat, it can live very well indoors. Nebblings prefer their own families and often keep a distance from strangers. They tend to bond with a select few humans and stay loving and devoted throughout their lives. It is, however, a cat that gladly accepts the company of its people or of another cat. Nebblings are very good communicators and will remind their owners of problems. This happens often since nebblings can be very picky about things such as litter cleanliness and food type. Norwegian Forest Cat They are friendly, intelligent, and generally good with people. The Norwegian Forest Cat has a lot of energy. They are very interactive cats who enjoy being part of their family environment and love to play games. Fanciers note that these cats produce a variety of high-pitched, chirping, vocalizations. Aka cat. Aka cats have inherited personality traits from both Siamese and Abyssinians, two breeds considered to be domesticated for many thousands of years. They will often greet your guests and are friendly and sociable. They are ideal pets for most households, generally tolerating gentle children and other pets. Ojos azules. Little is known about this breed, due to its rarity, but some have been known to be active, friendly, and affectionate. They are also easy to groom and do not require much brushing. Oriental Longhair. Longhairs, like their cousin breed the Siamese, have loud and expressive voices that are used often. They are smart cats, with some being quite willful and getting their own way. Many Orientals take to leash training quickly if started young. They have been known to open cabinets, doors and even refrigerators. This breed group is often recommended for more experienced cat keepers. Oriental Shorthair. Oriental Shorthair cats have high locomotion levels and are natural conversationalists. The adult oriental shorthair cats are considered to be active, curious and interested in surroundings by breeders and veterinarians. Persian. Persian cats don't like loud, hyper-households. They prefer to be in peaceful places around calm people that fit with their equally tranquil demeanor. But they can still be great family pets. Keep in mind, these are very discerning animals that will only bond with a few select people and are likely to play favorites. Peterbald. Peterbalds are sweet-tempered, affectionate, peaceful, curious, smart, and energetic. They are medium vocal and tend to follow their owners and want to be with them. Peterbalds typically live in harmony with other cats and pets, and also with children. Pixie Bob. Pixie Bobs are said to be highly intelligent, social, active, bold, and enjoy playing with other animals. They are also known for their chirps, chatters, and growls. Most meow scarcely if at all. Most pixie bobs are highly sociable around both their owners and strangers. Almost all pixie bobs like to be in the same room as their owners, and will follow them around the house. Ragamuffin. The ragamuffin is easy to get along with, forgiving, and patient. They enjoy a nice long snuggle with their family members, but they like to play and explore just as much. These cats do not have an enemy in the world, whether human or animal. 
They are not overly active, but they do enjoy spending time with toy balls, hanging toys, and cat gems. Ragdoll. The ragdoll is a sweetheart of a cat. She is laid back and content to spend time with you and your family. This breed is an excellent choice if you prefer a pet that isn't quite as vocal as some, such as a Siamese. She is also readily adaptable, which comes from her easygoing nature. The ragdoll is a curious cat. She'll try to figure things out for herself, making her seem like a toddler at times. Russian Blue. The Russian Blue cat is intelligent and friendly, although they can be quite shy around strangers, at least until they get to know them. Although she is friendly and affectionate, she does not tend to show his affection through cuddles. They will instigate any affection and may want to spend time near you but not necessarily on you. The Russian Blue can be quite vocal, so you should expect them to let you know when it is time to go out, come in, eat, play, or just to say hello. Savannah. Savannah cats are known for their loyalty and they will follow their owners around the house. They can also be trained to walk on a leash and to fetch. Scottish Fold. Calm and docile, these cats lack the high levels of energy that some cats possess but they're still playful and enjoy chasing toys. Scottish Folds love attention, but only on their terms. They'll let you know when your love is wanted. Selkirk Rex. The temperament of the Selkirk Rex reflects that of the breeds used in its development. They have a lot of the laid-back, reserved qualities of the British shorthair, the cuddly nature of the Persian, and the playfulness of the exotic shorthair. Siamese. Siamese cats are known for exhibiting behavior that's positively dog-like in many ways. They're extremely affectionate and even clingy, and they demand near-constant attention, whether it comes in the form of playtime or petting. As a result, they're not a good pet for anyone who can't dedicate a ton of time to them. If you're never home, other cat breeds can handle being alone for long periods, but the Siamese isn't one of them. Siberian. The Siberian is notoriously affectionate and loving toward their owners, leading them to often be described as dog-like cats. They love to be wherever their owners are and are never far away, happy to be a part of whatever it is their owner is up to, be it cooking, cleaning, or showering. Singapura. The Singapura is described by the CFA as active, curious, and playful. They are affectionate and desire human interaction. They have a tendency to perch on high places, to allow them a better view of their surroundings. The Singapura is playful and smart, and enjoys dog-like games such as fetch. Snowshoe. Snowshoes are generally affectionate, sweet-tempered, and mellow. They enjoy the company of humans and being given attention, and are compatible with children and other pets. Snowshoes are very social and docile, and show great devotion and love towards their owners. Consequently, the cats of this breed dislike being left alone for long periods of time and are able to cope with working hours better if they have another cat companion. Snowshoes may express themselves and their complaints vocally, though their meows are not as loud as the Siamese. It is not unusual for a snowshoe to look concerned, they generally have a worried or concerned expression on their face for the majority of the time. Somali. Intelligent, willful, and curious, the Somali is not a cat for the faint of heart. When they get an idea into their feline heads, they are happy to pursue it with uncanny vigor, even if this includes waiting until your back is turned to cause trouble. Happiest in homes with lots of stimulation, they will act out and destroy furniture if they aren't given frequent playtime and exercise. Sphinx. Sphinxes are some of the friendliest and most loving cats in the world, with many people comparing them to dogs in terms of demeanor. These are cats that will greet you at the door as soon as you get home, then follow you around the house until you leave again. They're welcoming towards strangers as well. They won't run and hide under the bed as soon as guests arrive, choosing instead to come out and greet them with enthusiasm. After all, new people are just new opportunities to get petted. Sufalak. Like other cat breeds originating from Thailand, the Sufalak is notably people-oriented. They are intelligent, affectionate and playful, often taking on more of a dog-like personality and characteristics. They are communicative, active, playful and do not like to be left alone or ignored. Thai. Thai cats are intelligent, affectionate, playful and vocal. If you're familiar with the personality of the Siamese breed, then know that Thai cats have a similar character. They're affectionate and loyal, so they enjoy living in a home where they'll have company for most of the day. Leaving a Thai cat home alone all day can make them stressed and anxious. Tonkinese. The Tonkinese is playful, curious, loving, and charismatic, and it loves getting attention and affection from its family. This includes kids and even other household animals. The cat is also an intensely intelligent feline and can even learn basic tricks, like fetching and giving you high fives. Toyger. 
The Toyger is an intelligent, affectionate, playful, and curious cat, and despite their wild and striking appearance, they are about as loving as they come. They are social animals that love to be close to their owners and adore a cuddle on the sofa. In fact, these cats become very attached to their owners and do not enjoy being left alone at home for long periods, a fact they'll quickly show you with potentially destructive behavior. If you are away from home for extended periods it's a great idea to get two kittens or have another equally friendly cat to keep them company, otherwise, this is not the breed for you. Turkish Angora Since they're highly intelligent, these cats love a good challenge. You'll need to keep your cat from getting bored by giving them puzzles and toys with treats inside for them to unlock. They also love to learn little tricks, so feel free to try to teach them anything, they're quick learners. More than just intelligent, these are very inquisitive cats. They like to open doors and cabinets and explore the area and look for some entertainment. They'll also turn on faucets and get into trouble to get your attention. Turkish Vanka DC Turkish vans have seemingly endless amounts of energy. They love to play, climb, jump, run, and just generally have fun. Like dogs, these cats love a good game of fetch. Unlike most other pets, they also love to play in the water and will do so for extended periods. Ukrainian Levkoi Ukrainian Levkois are friendly, playful, and intelligent cats. Levkois are very sociable, enjoying human or family company as well as the company of other domestic pets, dogs, rats, pigs. Unclothed Ukrainian Levkois do not need brushing but do need special skin care to give protection against direct sun and particularly cold conditions. York Chocolate The York Chocolate is a very friendly, even-tempered breed that is very content as a lap cat. They love to be held and cuddled. The cats are described as intelligent, energetic, and curious, happily following their owner around. They are good companions and good hunters, but sometimes they are shy. Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please feel free to leave a comment down below and let me know what breed I should talk about next. See you in the next videos.